Hi folks, this is Will from the American Association of Young Numismatists. What I'm going to talk to you about today is uh, uncirculated standing liberty quarters. I just have one piece with me. This is a nice, fully uncirculated 1930s standing liberty quarter with a nice, beautiful cartwheel luster, probably an MS-64 and MS-65 on the line between a full head and not full head. For those of you who are wondering, a full head coin um, deals with how well struck up Liberty's head is. If you can see all the details on her head, um, that means the coin was fully struck up, and it's, or at least that part was fully struck up, and it's considered a full head coin, and it's worth more than a normal piece. Um, the actual specifics of what qualifies as a full head versus not are a little bit iffy, but for somebody at the beginner level, just understand that um, a full head means most of the hair detail, uh, most of the head details are present. Like uh, there's some leaves across Liberty's um, the side of Liberty's head that you're supposed to be able to see, and uh, her e Liberty's ear hole you're supposed to be able to see. But this coin is kind of right on the line between a full head and not. Regardless, it's a nice lustrous coin with pretty few contact marks.